Hello everyone, welcome back to another tutorial today. Um, we are building a city on Roblox Studio. So, yeah. We're back, it's part two. So what we're gonna do today is we're gonna fix this traffic light cause this is not good. So let's actually turn off collisions and move this. Either that, or we actually rotate the traffic light. So, let's actually do this. Now, what we're gonna do now is actually take a little test drive. So I'm gonna plop in a card that I just imported. You can grab a car from the free models if you want. So here's my little test vehicle. I'm gonna plop it right, uh, let's see, right here. Let's see how well we did our roads. Uh, now let's just go over here, click this little play button. Then around where my mouse is, should be play here. Of course, I'm clicking this part, clicking that, then right where my mouse is, there should be a play here icon. Let's just click that. Well, if you're wanting the test test drive your roads. We will now be do starting this new tutorial, so Go to my models, purchase the Dark Eyes Highway Kit and the Road Sign Kit, and come back to this video once you're done. By now, I'm assuming you probably purchased them by now, so let's start with the roof. Now, once you enter your Road Sign Kit, and you'll be greeted with this. You have Interstate signs. Oh, you're agreed with this sign. Speed limit signs up to, from 5 to 85 in miles per hour, not kilometers an hour. And then there's yield, stop, and do not enter. So let's ungroup this model or press Control U. Then you will have this. To work with for now we're just gonna we're gonna we're gonna drag all of this at the side and we will be inserting a speed limit of 40 miles an hour so let's bring that up P plop it right here duplicate it and rotate it which is control D to duplicate and control R to rotate and move this speed limit sign to a place where they can see it for these roads you can also drag this control D control R twice move it and of course you gotta turn on the move on stud and plop it so it attaches properly and now you could just continue driving your road and you can actually insert side roads here so let's actually insert a side road delete these two Delete these two ones right here and just fill them up. Alt, delete, and just move this right along. And then we'll go over to our intersection, plop this, control V, which copies and pastes them, then put it right here.
And speaking of that, go over back to your road sign kit, wherever you put it, control D a stop sign, and bring it to where you're where you're stopping, which is around right here. So let's insert the stop sign. And again, adjust, I'm going to just adjust the speed limit signs for the whole sake of this video. Um, and then, we now have road signs. And speaking of road signs, the Dot Guys Highway Kit has signs automatically installed, so... Now, go over to your models, insert the Dot Guys Highway Kit, if you want to build highways in this city, you have them right here. Now, control you if you want, but warning. I'm just warning you, this this is gonna be very super powerful. So just ungroup by going over here, ungroup, and there you go. You now have it. That's select this one I want to select this one so let's go back over here rotate it and then just drag it back over there because we're gonna have to move our road kit now Then, let's pop it over here. And of course, copy and paste these. have this. A nice fantastic highway. We will be using this very very soon. So we will be putting this over here with our road. It varies what, what highway you want to use. If you want to use that one it's completely fine. But if you want to use this it's also completely fine. So now what you want to do is so now if you want all right so now once you insert this highway you can pretty much stretch it as long as you want you can add more exits if you want you can do all that fun stuff now we're gonna test our vehicle and see if our if it works with the bridge and again we're having our speed limit is 40 miles an hour please anchor the sign kit or else I will says right now yes you can march into highway just fine and once you guys insert that into your game it should be just fine no need to anchor it so right here yep you have your speed limit you have your bridge now what you want to do is continue building your awesome roads so I'll be back once I get into once I finish my roads anyway guys here is a tip if you want to build intersections like this you just gotta do what I just did earlier in the video put it in duplicate it and then 
put it right here, then duplicate it four times. Make sure it kind of aligns, like right here, exactly aligns. Otherwise, it's going to be messed up. So now you have this cool little intersection. All right, back to building. All right, another trick that you can do is building cul-de-sacs. And what you want to do is go over here, select cylinder, control R, control control R twice. Contr okay, let me do this again. All right, insert a cylinder, control R twice, then click control T. So now you got that. Now just go back, make sure you have one stud. Go back and just make it as big, but make sure it fits the road pretty good. So now Now what I did is put make it black and then make made the material as concrete. And if you want for best for best proper working, just move it. Just make sure that you can just Plop it in easy like that. Then just plop it in right here. Yeah, I guess that's good. So you just made your very own cul-de-sac. And anyway, yeah, I built a street right here. So let's continue building. Alrighty, so here's my little sample street. Let me just, uh, actually, no, I guess that's good. Let me just remove these. So now you have this. If you want, you could just build like this. Then you could just continue building on your actual like main road, which I guess is where your businesses are gonna be. Your like chain buildings. If you want, you could build like maybe a McDonald's or something, build a gas station. Huh. Well, it varies. Then, just do... Then just... Then just put copyright free stuff. Like, put a Wig Douglas instead of, like, of a McDonald's. So anyway, yeah, uh, let's... Now let's continue building. Anyway, yeah, new strategy. You could either just do that or build what I did. In Anyway, so that's how you extend the Dak Eyes Rookhead. Just use gap fill, and once you follow my steps and stuff, you'll actually manage to build a pretty decent road. Fire spreading all around my room My world's so bright It's hard to breathe But that's alright Hush Alright, do this Plop this in And then, again, you can just go ahead Copy-paste this Make sure it like, actually like extends to the back area there that it's pretty easy and simple same with this one why can't you just let me eat my weight and glee i live inside my in a way yeah this is what we got now right here 
Alright, th speaking about it now, I want to make this area like a suburban place, so like, where people, where houses are and stuff. Which will be going on part three, so, yeah. We will be extending downtown very soon, when part four comes. But for now, I'm gonna, just going to do part three and just introduce you guys to simple water and stuff if you want so like and subscribe if you want that um anyway guys yeah that's gotta be pretty much it um for now at least so we're gonna give this thing one more test drive around the around this little city we made or road whatever you <laughs> whatever you call it <sighs> sorry we're gonna we're gonna do it and we're just gonna drive across the little city area so let's just take a nice little tour across our little city shall we No! No! Runaway vehicle! Runaway vehicle! <laughs> Alright, so yeah, there's that. Um, let me just hop back in to the highway. Anyway, so, uh, so anyway, yeah, that's going to be it for this video. So, yeah, run away. Run away your Mercedes. Just crashing roads on roads on top of roads. It's just going to drive all the way into oblivion at nighttime. So, 
<laughs> Alright guys, thank you thank you so much for watching. I hope you have an awesome day. And I'll catch you all later. Peace out and have a fantastic day.